Hello everybody, welcome back to Dead by Daylight. That's right, the Xenomorph is finally here. And today I'm going to be playing him, but I'm also going to be playing a match with Ellen Ripley, who is the survivor who accompanied the Xenomorph into, his, into the realm. So let's waste no more time, let's go ahead and play a game as the Xenomorph, and then one as Ellen. Oh, okay, so we got Toba Landing, which was... Well, for some reason, the Nostromo Landing is in Toba Landing. Well, Nostromo Wreckage, whatever. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead, I'm going to highlight, and then I'm going to enter Tunnel. Okay. Alright, come on. What? Alright, come on. Oh, that's not good. Oh, come on. What do you want from me, Kate? Come here. What? Oh, man. There we go. I'm getting somewhere. Not much where, but... What? What was that? Bye? Oh. 
I'm just gonna pick you up. I'll leave you alone. Honestly, I probably should like try to use the tunnels as much as I can. The tail attack is a little bit hard to use. Bruh. What? Okay. Well, that happened. I don't think she is, though. No, she's not. Okay. Because I do have the Mori. What? Hmm. You can go in the basement. Come on. Let's go to the basement. Oh, wow. The coloring, though. I like it. All right. All right. What? Come on. Not very good with this tail tag. I'm also I checked to see if you were... No, you're not. Okay. So everyone's on death hook. Ooh, another one. Bruh. Bruh. You're coming with me, bucko! That's right, you're coming with me. Come on, let's do it! Boom! Right in the back. Ah, oh, here comes the insane part. 
Ooh. Yeah, you like that, huh? Yeah. Do you want me to? Okay, I'm doing it. <laughs> I'm doing it. Ooh. Right in the head. All right. Let's go inside the tunnel. Take a look at this bad boy. Oh, that's beautiful. Look at this. How long did that take it? How long did that take to make? Because that's beautiful. Like, that is beautiful. The amount of things that they did for this update is beautiful. <laughs> oh, man. And that Mori's sick. That's probably my favorite Mori. Okay. So now we're going to be playing a game as Ellen Ripley, which should take a lot less time because, well, more people are wanting to play the Xenomorph than Ripley. So let's get into it. So with the Xenomorph came, came Ripley, Ellen Ripley, and she, I would say, is a lot of fun. She's got two other cosmetics. One is from the second Aliens movie, which is Aliens, and it looks a little something like this. And the second one is Ripley 8, who technically is her own separate character, but she is a cosmetic for R Ellen Ripley. Now the alien, this is pretty cool, the alien has the Xenomorph Queen, has the Xenomorph Clone, and the Grid Xenomorph. This one apparently is from the Predator vs. Aliens, or Aliens vs. Predators, depending on how you want to say it. Which means that Alien is possibly going to be the next license to come into DBD. Maybe. It's not 100%. Because we thought that last time with um, the Tools of Torment chapter. And we ended up getting Skull Merchant and the two Lyra siblings. But anyways, let's move, let's move on from that. And let's actually play a game as Ellen. Oh, thank God, it is the Xenomorph. Unless that's a singularity box. Let's find out. Nope, nope, it's an Xenomorph. Okay, sweet. Alright, grab a turret. Now do I butt this bad boy? Put it right here. Because there's not a lot of room. Hey! Thank you. I'm, I'm watching that tunnel. That tunnel's kind of freaking me out. I went through about three other matches trying to get the Xenomorph. Oh gosh, I got caught on the wall. But it's okay, because he did too. Huh? That actually made me jump. Alright. That model. It's so cool. Might be kind of hard to use the turrets on this map because it's such like an enclosed map. The turrets are a little bit... They have to be in a radius. I don't know if you noticed that. So they, they might be a little bit hard to use on this map. But there's only one way to find out. And that's to get me off of this hook so I can figure this out. Okay. There's a Gus Johnson. What a name. That's a Nicolas Cage too. Actually, yeah, that's kind of fitting. Oh my god. Oh, you are so lucky. Alright. 
Fung. Come here, Fung. Let Nicolas Cage and Ellen Ripley heal you. <laughs> Uh, that's great. Oh, well, she's down. So let me grab another turret. So they seem to be heavy. See right there, there's the radius. Okay. I think that's when the tail is powered up because I think I heard that one a few times in my Xenomorph match of course that was about 30 minutes ago as I had to play several games just to get the Xenomorph somehow right. Ellen Ripley heals Ellen Ripley awesome oh my God. just what I need the exact kind of action footage I need guys cut on camera Ellen Ripley is healing Ellen Ripley <sighs> oh that's great Right. My match as the Xenomorph went really well, though. Like, I think that was probably one of my best matches as him. I've played about maybe three matches as him. <sighs> Man, see, I like that. Just put this turret down. Alright, now we're gonna fix this generator. Oh, Afro Penguin's down. Gus Johnson's on the hook, and now he's picking up Afro Penguin. Okay, maybe it was a mistake for my found for the founding fathers to give me rights to. Wait, what? Look at that! <gasps> oh, I should not have done that. Oh. Come on, we got this. He's picking up Afro Penguin again. Alright, generator. Uh, well, there's a turret right here, so I might as well just grab it. Might as well just grab it and bring it over here. Never mind. Oh no, he's not. Okay, well, grab it back. There we go. Oh, that's not good. Oh. Wait. You are an idiot. Now you're probably dead. Oh, no, you're not. Okay. Oh, the moonwalk! Oh, the moonwalk is just great! Yeah, 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 I know. Why do we not have a generator done yet? Oh, thank you! Now I break out! Bye! Alright, sweet. Okay. Now I need to stop goofing around. I need to actually do a generator. There's a turret in there, and I guess I can go ahead and grab it and place it in the center of the room. So let's do that. I can't believe you're allowed to have flame turrets, like, and they don't burn the equipment. Man, I love DVD sometimes. Okay. You're thanking me for this. If I get downed, you're. S Guys, he's coming back. He's coming back. He's a coming. Dead eyes are coming. There he is, I saw that tail. Oh, man, I gotta find a generator. We're still at five gens, one of our teammates down. And dead. I guess I'll just take you with me. Come on, we're going on a trip in our favorite rocket ship. Zooming through the skies. Little Einstein! 
This is not going to be very helpful because the generator is cramped in this corner and there's not a lot of space between me and the Xenomorph. If it crawls out, I'm screwed. So that means I gotta be very careful. I could probably put a bomb on that pallet though. Put one. Is he frozen? Probably is. Just get out of here. Uh oh. Well, now I'm screwed. <laughs> Alright, finally, good lord, a generator's done. Yes, grab me. Thank you. How is she hit it? Like, like, is she just punching at his arms to let her go? Is it kind of like the Singularities Mori, where you just punch at the Singularities claw to try to get him to drop you? It's hard to tell. Anyways. Hopefully the teammates come and get me. That was not good. That was absolutely terrifying. That was scary. What was that? Come on, Nick. Come on, Nick. No, no, I'm dead now. No, I'm dead. Wait. Fang, are you going to be able to do it? No, you're not. He's coming right back. Uh, it doesn't matter. That was still really fun. That was a lot of fun. I love this killer. And the survivor. This might be my new main. Well, second main. <laughs> uh, anyways, let's get back to the lobby. I guess before I go, I should probably show, like, the lobby animation with Jones. So if you wait in the lobby for long enough, Jones will eventually appear right here. And he'll come rub his head up against Ellen's leg. Then she'll smile and kneel down and start playing with him. So let's see if we can get it. There he is! Look at that. Oh, that's so cute. Get the little kitty. He's a good boy. Space kitten. I can't believe the entity actually allowed the cat in the realm. Even in the trials. If only I'd gotten the Nostromo wreckage, you could have seen that Jones sometimes appears in the lockers. But anyways, that's all I'm going to be doing today. Definitely get this DLC. I do have to warn you, this is a little bit more expensive than the typical One Survivor One Killer DLC. And that's because when you buy the DLC, you get this outfit. And it's a controversial topic. I, I quite like it, but I understand why some people want there to be like a separate option, or just like not doing this. But I still quite like the outfit. Anyways, that's what I'm going to be doing today. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.